All right, everyone, here is my latest rehab home. Just wanted to do a quick before video for you all. Kind of let you know what I'm looking at doing here. I'm going to have the whole exterior painted two-tone gray, do lighter gray on the siding and then darker gray on the brick. Of course, it's getting a brand new roof as well. Every home I bought lately needs a roof, so good time to tie everything together. You know, coming in here, we'll put carpet on the stairs. Um, good sized family room here. Just finish it. There really needs to be nothing done. Just paint it and finish it up. I'm going to put new trim, new lights, all that sort of thing. I'm going to put carpet in the front room, vinyl flooring that I usually use here in the hallway and the kitchen. Don't like this tile, so I will be replacing that. Um, that fan needs to be replaced. And then I'm going to redo the whole kitchen. Uh, the cabinets to me just, they look outdated. So going to put in all new white cabinets from Lowe's to make it look really nice in here. New countertop, rip, rip out this pantry there, uh, put the fridge back where it belongs. Then I'm gonna have a pantry put over against that wall. Just have plenty of storage for the kitchen. Just kind of finish it up, make it look really nice. Um, like I said, new vinyl flooring. And then, of course, new doors, new trim, all that fun stuff. But these two bedrooms upstairs are massive. I mean, you probably can't tell from the video very well, but uh, really good sized bedrooms. There's two up and two down. So once again, just <clears throat> trim, paint, carpet, put new doors on, the closets. Bathroom's gonna be redone as well. Going to have new flooring, redo all the tile around the shower, pull that all out, new net knobs, valves, that sort of thing. Just spice up the bathroom a little bit. Another large size bedroom here upstairs. The light doesn't work. Same thing, just uh, bifold doors, carpet trim, paint. Now let's go downstairs. <clears throat> this home's located kind of behind Syracuse High School. So it's a good area. It's a really sought after area. This room right here downstairs is going to be finished. Another massive bedroom. I mean, really, really good sized bedrooms in this home, but definitely needs to be finished. So same thing, closet, tram, doors, paint, Whole nine yards down here. Little family room here. Uh, debating if I want to turn this into a bedroom for five bedrooms or just leave it as a four bedroom home. Um, not sure yet. I know it's nice to have that second space. You know, they have the front room upstairs, but this would be another massive bedroom. So I could put a 45 door here bring the wall out to here and then to here and then put a door in right here to have it as a really big bedroom. So I'm debating on that. I'll have to run some comps and see if it's worth going to a five bedroom or just leave it a four. Here's the other bedroom downstairs. This is the smallest room in the house by far, but still bedroom. Got the window and got the closet. So what do you guys think? Five bedroom home, turn this into a big bedroom or should I leave this as a big entertainment area? I'd love to hear your thoughts on this one because I'm torn. Then, of course, another bathroom here, three-quarter shower. That's all you need downstairs. Um, this is the utility laundry room, storage room in the basement. Laundry goes over there against that wall. Good storage, you know, if you need to put all your canned foods and whatnot. Good place to put it. And go outside here. Good size, you know, fenced yard out here. Nice shed. I believe there's two sheds. Yeah, there's that little one right there. My roofer is heading to the home here later this week, putting a brand new roof on, ripping the swamp cooler off. 
gonna be a nice black roof. I love my black roofs. I think they look better. Remember, this will all be painted two-tone gray. Dark gray on the on the bottom and light gray on the siding. The black roof. It's gonna look really, really nice. If any of you need a swing set, please let me know. Always happy to help. But yeah, that's my latest rehab home here in Clearfield. Syracuse High is just over that direction. So uh, if any of you thinking about moving, buying your first home, upgrading, let me know. You always add a garage one day. Right there on the side, a little one car. My first home that I purchased back in the day in Hooper, it didn't have a garage. It was just like this home. It was almost a spitting image. And I ended up adding a garage to it. It's a really nice home. My buddy loves it there. So uh, let me know your thoughts. Turn this into a five bedroom home or a four bed with another family room. That's the golden question on this home. So thanks everyone. Hope you're all doing well. And of course, if any of you are curious what your home's worth, if you're thinking of upgrading, please reach out to me. I'd love to help you. This is obviously what I do all day, every day. I love to help people. So hope you all have a great week. Happy Monday. And this home's going to be awesome when I'm all done with it. So excited to show you the after video.